What's good? Capital Bro C guys and welcome back to a solo, solo video. It's been a minute uh, for my solo, so me being alone in front of the camera. But yeah, uh, I'm gonna try to keep this video very short and quick. The title obviously is giving it away. But today I wanna talk about trading and basically, okay, so obviously not all the time, but most of the time trading. Uh, but basically how to create your own trading bot. So I wouldn't say I've done create my own trading bot. So this is basically a video for you and me to get started together, if I can put it that way. I've been in Forex for about three years. I would say about profitable, non-profitable also. I mean, between the lines, just, just barely across the line, if I have to put it that way. But now I wanna go on to the next step. So I, I'm a full-time software developer and it's quite kind of hard sometimes to for my strategy to be in front of the charts. So uh, I've been looking into bots. So it's it's not called a bot or sometimes it is, it's called a trading EA. So yeah, I'm trying to put HP3 with the strategy, my strategy into a bot. So this is like the first, obviously not gonna happen now. It's gonna take quite a time to do this, but today is basically getting across the starting point. So I've been looking into it for about a week or two, but obviously I'm not gonna do it myself. We're gonna have some AI or ChatGPT or whatever to help me with this. So first of all, let's get a background of what a trading EA is. So it's basically a trading EA or trading expert advisor is an automatic software program that executes trades in a financial market such as Forex on your behalf. So a bot. These are the rules for basically on your rules, what you give this trading bot, it will execute the trades. So that's background. So where do you start? So first of all, you're gonna need MT5 on the PC. This won't work on the mobile app. So for the mobile traders, you won't be able to do this or the way I'm doing it, there might be ways, but for this way, you won't be able to do it on the phone. So you need MT5 on the PC. So first of all, you're gonna need MT5 on the PC. Let me just open that first. So you guys can see, oh, here we go, MT5, wow. We got MT5 and, you all have, oh, and you're gonna need is meta trader there, that sound effects. So not a fan guys of MT5, but if you're gonna be setting up it as a bot, we will be have to use it, but luckily you won't be looking at this, it will be the bot. So that, and you'll be needing meta editor five. So this is where we are writing the code. So you can see already have some demo code. So this is HP3 at its base root. So it's it's not done yet. So I just wanted to show you guys. So this is at its base root. So you're gonna need these two things, uh, MD5, Meta Editor, uh, editor of Meta Editor 5, and in ChatGPT or whatever AI system, it can be deep, it can be cursor, it can be any of those. So let's go back. So this is where you're gonna ask, like you can basically, whatever your strategy. So we will just say, hey ChatGPT, create a EA for MT5, uh, then we can just say the rules is when the market, for example, open, check the candle. Okay, let's just know you have to be very specific with this because this is where you, for example, you have your rule. So you need to give the rule to the team. The AI is basically just following your command. So this is just demo to show you guys. So I created an MT5, EA for MT5. The rules is when the market opens for London, let's just say for London for London, check the candle to see if it's a bullish or bearish and take the trade based, oh, my spelling based of that. Risk is 1%, for example, I'm just adding 1% of account with 50 pips for profit, uh, for, let's just say for TP and SL. So now you have your rules. So this is going to be whatever your rules is, your knowledge, your demand, supplies and whatever, and then you just search it. So now the AI will be working its magic. So thinking longer for a better answer, blah, 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 blah. So now in the meantime, while the AI is doing that, so if you want to add an expert advisor to your thing, for example, you will have your pay, you'll have GP. First of all, you're gonna to have to have a broker. So you can just log in like here, for example, open account, XM if you want a broker, the link will be down below. So op XM, so first of all, prop firms, some prop firms do not allow bots, but most of the personal brokers, XM, HFM. So I'll, I'll prefer HFM if you want to do this, open an account with them. Then you can just link your account, log in here, for example, 
open account, then here you can see XM, you have HFM, search your account, login with your credentials, it will be here, and then your account will be here. You can see I just made a demo one, which is 9K, just to test out, because first of all, there's gonna be a lot of testing with your EA, it won't happen overnight, this can take a few months, so I feel like HP3, this one, to where I want it, will probably only be next year, but this is a starting point to get it to that point, if you get what I mean. But yeah, once you have logged in with the broker or whatever, you're gonna you're gonna come here basically on top. You're gonna say insert. So this is where you're gonna say experts. You can see here I have my HP three alpha three. So you can just click this, and then you're gonna say it as it. You can see here on top. Here's another pop up. You're not seeing this pop up. It's another screen. Yeah, basically just the rules. You'll see this will only show up once you have properties in your EA. You can just say okay, and there it's basically in the thing. So it will start trading. But my EA is not executing. It's just telling me the range. So I'm building on top of it. So to create a EA, you'll basically go on top again. You go to tools, for example, yeah, if I do remember, yeah. So you'll basically go to Metal Code's language editor, and then it will open this here. So this is where you'll get your editor. So once you want to create a new one, you'll basically just go to new, new project. So uh, Expert Advisor has a template and is generated. So I'll just click template for now. Then yeah, you can just give it a name, which I'm just going to give, like for example, test two again. And then you're gonna say next. You're gonna say none of these because these are on functions. You don't need to worry about this as it gives you default functions on trace. So I'll just say next, then on test and next, finish for now. So yeah, it will give you basically some stuff where you can just start, then go to your EA. So here is your EA code, for example. So then you go back to your chat GPT. So yeah, it has the EA based of your rule. So this is where I say it's gonna be a lot of refinement. So what you do is you take this entire thing, copy it, Come back to the thing, basically just overwrite this, delete that, add this, and then you can just test it. So there is some error, so most of the time the errors might be here. So what you can do is just take this all these errors, for example, the, the entire thing, so you can just say this, 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 control it, see it. So for timing purposes, guys, I'm not gonna because I'm, I'm running a little bit late on the time for this recording. So you'll come back here, paste it, give it to ChatGPT. So it's gonna take a lot of back and forward. So Gotcha is gonna fix it. But now I'm just gonna show you HP3 in the meantime. So once I come to, for example, mine, which is the other one, you just say open, open project, experts, where is yes, HP3. So here we have HP3, so I'm gonna compile it again. As you can see, HP3 do not have any compile errors. So let me just do it again, yeah. So let's just stop it and let's go file. So it basically automatically is compiling and then like I showed you how to add it. So you will play around with your EA just to make it work. So you don't need coding experience, So, but you need you need problem solving. Uh, there's a reference. You need problem solving skills for this way, but you don't need uh, coding skills. So once you have it, playing around because it's not gonna happen in the first day, you're gonna have to learn. So once you play around with it, you can come to MT500 PC, start learning maybe the execution. Like I might make it another part because like I said, I'm still learning. So this is just for us to learn together. So once you have that, basically play around with your strategy. See if it is actually, it at London open the first candle, bearish or bullish. If it goes up or down, it executes on your demo account and then see if it does with 50 pips. So once we have that, that only we can go on to a second start refining a little bit, more testing, a lot of testing, not more, a lot of testing, and then you'll have your ear basically to the point where you don't need to trade. So yeah, so that's today's video. Not short, it's quite a, quite a lot to take in, but yeah, that's, it is a starting point to creating. So I might make a part two, might not, but yeah. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and if you're looking for a broker, HFM, the link is down below. Sign up using the link, you know, all that jazz but yeah i'm capital bro c i'll see you guys in another one peace out